What's up everybody? This is Eric from Eats Computer Solutions. So I got the LG G7 and look what just popped up on my T-Mobile version. We getting that pie love. Wow, that's what I'm talking about. About time we start to get that pie love on these LG phones. I already made a video about the V40, uh, but the uh, LG G7 just got that pie love. So let me go to install it and let's breeze through the OS. So sit back and relax and get your popcorn ready because we got that pie love on the LG G7. Let's go. All right, guys, so I got the latest software on the LG G6, the LG G7, and the LG G8. All right, I got all three phones in the building, and uh, one of my the frustrations with LG was the older devices uh, not getting any updates. Now, the LG G6 is still sitting on Android 8.0 with January 1, 2019. All right, so it's still a little outdated. Hopefully, LG will fix the LG G6. Now, this is the LG G7, all right, and it just got that pile of. So that is the LG G7, and we're gonna go through the OS a little bit, uh, but it got the pile up. Let me go and show you guys. Android 9 with May 2019 security patch. And on the LG G8, we got that pile up already, uh, but we got April 1st, uh, 2019 security patch. All right, so one of the questions a lot of people are asking me uh, when I make these videos about updates, it's about the camera software. So I wanna go into the camera software so I can show y'all guys the difference in camera software on all devices. All right, so as you can see right here, kind of beam in a little bit so y'all guys can see some of this stuff here. All right, so as you can see all three camera software, but on the newer versions, well on the newer device here, on the LG G8, you got more features all right, you have studio, portrait, auto, uh, AI cam, manual camera, and more, which if you go into more, you get slow more and all that stuff like that. Even though the LG G7 just got updated to Pi Love, uh, it's, we don't have all the camera features. Uh, and uh, as you can see, all the camera features are different. Uh-oh, let me go back, go back to the camera. Right, everything should be the same, but unfortunately, it's not. But uh, as you can see, your manual mode is stuff there, uh, and everything in between. And if we go here, kind of the same camera app on the LG G7 and the LG G6. All right, so uh, if you look at the camera app on the LG G6 versus the LG G7, uh, look like we got a little more features on the LG G6 versus the LG G7, but uh, all three of the camera apps are different. All right, and if you go into, and let's go into the settings on all devices, show you guys really quick. And it should be, you know, across the board, uniform across the board with all three devices. Well, at least two devices, but unfortunately, uh, we don't have that on the LG G7 and the LG G8. A setting screen, right? Nine removable battery. <laughs> I always joke around about that. But if you look at both uh, settings here, you have basically the same, which is great. All right. So um, if you go into your extensions, the same. Uh, and everything looks the same. A lot of enhancements under the hood. Now, you do see difference there. Now, you don't have the same color palette uh, with the LG G8 versus the LG G7. Still different. All right. And uh, you would think that if you're on Android 9 here versus Android 9 here, you would see some uh, kind of uniform uh, icons here. But unfortunately, you don't see it. And let me go ahead and pull out the LG G6 there, even though I got a dark palette. Uh, it's the same as the LG G6 going into the LG G7. So you don't see a lot of differences there between LG G6 and LG G7. But I would think that going from, you know, Android 8 to Android 9 with both of these devices, it would be the same. Unfortunately, it's not. 
All right, guys, so before I end this video, I just want to let you know that I am running Nova Launcher on all my devices. So just so you know, uh, the reason why my device look different, uh, not stock, but a little different, is because I'm running Nova Launcher on uh, all my devices. It's my launcher of choice. Uh, and the reason why is because I am not a fan of the stock launcher, but it doesn't interfere with anything else as far as the, uh, uh, the settings or anything. But as far as the home screen, I'm using Nova Launcher because Nova Launcher is good for me uh, and it brings in the app draw that I like and everything. So I wanted to tell y'all guys just real quick before I end this video that I am using Nova Launcher on all my uh, devices of choice. Also, when it comes down to the performance, uh, man, the performance on the LG G7 has always been fast. So I've never had a problem with, with performance out of this device. Anytime I wanted to play anything in the app store or anything in between, uh, performance has been great. So it's good to see the Pi Love update for this device and I'm really liking it. Uh, and I really do think that LG needs to upgrade uh, and update the LG G6. This is Eric from Easy Computer Solutions. Leave your comments down below. Let me know what you think about that pie love and all this glory. And if you got the LG G7 on T-Mobile, go ahead on and get that update. This is Eric. See you guys on the next video. Peace.